Hi guys, welcome to Adam McCola TV. There are four days to go of the transfer window and Johnny Evans is set to join West Bromwich Albion. Sky Sports are reporting that United and West Brom have agreed a fee for the player. There's no sign as to what that fee is, although a few papers last week were saying United have put a price tag of £12 million on his head. I doubt we would have got £12 million, if we're honest. So I'd expect the fee to be confirmed between 7 to 9, maybe. What do you think? Um, but Johnny Evans is set to join Darren Fletcher, ex-Manchester United, football genius at the Hawthorns. What do you make of the move? Now, obviously, a lot of Manchester United fans on Twitter and stuff like that have been saying good riddance to bad rubbish, blah, blah, blah. Now, I think that is a little bit out of order. Will we miss Johnny Evans from a playing perspective? No, we won't. Um, because his form in the last 12 to 18 months just hasn't been to the standard that you'd expect of a centre-half at Manchester United. But he's not been the only player to show poor form, not the only defender to show poor form either. And Johnny Evans is a player that when Vidic and Real Ferdinand were at the club, showed signs of fantastic potential. He's a ball-playing centre-half. He likes to bring the ball out of defence, pass the ball, so on and so forth. And I was one of those players that believed Johnny Evans would go on and grow and become a top centre-half for Manchester United. Unfortunately, he didn't fulfil the potential that he had for whatever reason. And when Rio and Vidic left and you expect him to take a you know, stand up and be counted, he just wasn't. Um, there was talk about him being the captain of Manchester United, which shows the potential that he did have. And it's disappointing that he didn't fulfil it. His family are all Manchester United fans. His brother played, you know, has been at the club as well. Um, so it's disappointing to see him leave. But of course, it is the right decision. Um, I just wish United fans wouldn't be so unfair on him. Guys, let me know what you think. Because obviously now, Evans has gone. The papers are saying Evans and Valdez to leave. Nobody else to come in. Louis van Arle in his presser was saying, you know, if I get something, then I'll announce it. That's the only time you'll find out. Um, there's been links to like shock bids for Bale and Muller and Neymar, but nothing that we really expect to come off. Do you see Manchester United bringing anybody in? Would you be worried if we didn't? Get your comments in below. Let us know what you think about Johnny Evans leaving Manchester United after 198 games and seven goals and about who you'd like to see come in. If anybody, comment below, subscribe, like the video. See you later.